Good morning, I just woke up right down the street from a laundromat. I have a lot of laundry to do. I don't know how, because I literally just did laundry last week when I got back from Columbia. This entire bag is full. I'm doing my sheets and blankets, and it's gonna be a lot. I hate doing laundry. All right, let's see if I can carry all this in here at one time. Ooh. Super wash and dry. The medium-sized washers are $8, it's insane. something I need to find Wi-Fi so that I can upload another YouTube video and then I might go sit at the beach okay change of plans we are stopping at Walmart picking up a couple things that I need and heading to a shop that one of my friends works at because he's working on the exact same van that I just bought same style same roof everything and I kind of want to just see what he's building in it to get ideas for how difficult it would be if I do want to build it out or not but yeah, I just want to go check it out get some ideas also just visit the shop my friends are there all the time and I've never been by so I'm gonna go check it out after Walmart what a beaut. Eye drops for my allergies, two gallons of water, and a rotisserie chicken. Such a strange grocery list. Put these jugs of water in here somewhere. So for lunch today, I'm gonna take the Southwest salad, dump it into a wrap with a bunch of chicken that I pull off the rotisserie chicken, make myself a little wrap. I've been getting even more lazy recently, putting my tortillas directly over the fire. I kind of like that it like burns them a little bit. I like that burnt taste. It doesn't cook them like overall as well as in a pan, but I don't know, I kind of like it. Pull some chicken, salad, wrap, put it all together. Got the nice crispy wrap, pull some chicken apart. And the chips, sauce. And that is going to be a delicious wrap. A little bit over full, as usual. Mm, it's freaking delicious. And I really want cold water, so I'm going to put one of, the, one of them in the freezer. Clean this up, and we'll hit the road. All right. Ow. My eyes are so messed up. Oh, they're so itchy. And I can't even hide them with sunglasses because I just stepped on my sunglasses last night when I got on the ambulance. Now I have no sunglasses. Off to the shop. All right, we made it. Let's go check it out. Got my friend Kyle's van right there, a school bus. Oh, we got Nikita. Is it? Wait, this is yours? Yeah. I haven't okay. even seen this yet. What? Really? I like it. I like it. Cool, I wanna go, oh yes, I need to check out this van <laughs> yeah, right here. Yes. How you doing? Hey, What's up, I'm Brandon. Dave. Nice to meet you, man. Same. Are you the Narpender? Yes. Ah, okay, nice to finally meet you. Hands are a What's up? Dead. This thing, this thing is a, this is like pretty much exactly what I just bought. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Leaving the shop now and heading down to the beach to go meet up with Steven and just kind of relax and be beach bums today because I'm feeling very lazy. It was really cool to see that van that's exactly like the one I bought get good ideas in my head of uh, how to build it out. So yeah, let's head to the beach. All right, I lucked out. I got myself a spot right up against the beach. There was only like two spots left and I couldn't fit in the other one. Smushing the bed up there, moving this thing and opening the doors and I was gonna be a lazy bum. Doesn't get much better than this. These are all clean, but these are all my clothes that I use to work on things and the dirt bike was in the way But I keep all that stuff in here. That's where all that's about to go I got a bunch of money left over from buying the van a couple days ago Put this in there too. That's not normally where it stays I have a much more secure spot, but for right now, that's where it's going. We got another rotisserie pulled chicken Salad chipotle mayo wrap. That's the meal for early dinner, late lunch. Beautiful. Mm. 
few hours later and we are done being beach bums. I'm gonna head over to a spot to sleep for the night. A friend of mine actually told me there's a nice street to park on right outside of a climbing gym and we're all actually going to the climbing gym tomorrow morning anyway, so perfect. I'm gonna go look for this road. One of my friends is already parked there in his ambulance. I'll stop rambling. All right, this is home for the night. I actually stayed over on that street on the other side before there wasn't any room. There was a lot of spots, but none big enough to fit the ambulance. I found this side and there's another van and a giant box truck and I'm sticking out into the road a little bit. It's gonna have to do. I'm gonna post up and edit for the rest of the night, wake up in the morning and go rock climbing. Good morning. <coughs> Good morning. It is 8.30 in the morning. I went to sleep at like 2.30 or three from staying up too late editing. Let's head over to the rock climbing gym. I need to go to the bathroom and I don't have one in the ambulance. Hmm. Let's roll. This is the spot that I parked at last night. Not too bad. Wow, I am tired. And there is Jared's massive ambulance right over there. We're gonna go park right next to him. This thing is just insane. Look how much higher his mirror is than mine. And like, my ambulance is huge. Yeah, pop, breakfast? pop the door. What, what do you got? Impossible sausage and egg burritos with some hummus. That actually sounds amazing. Is that a yes? Yeah. Hash browns? Got them. Yeah. yeah. Good. Oh. Oh, no, not quite. Almost. It's enough room for me to get out. So you're moved into this thing now. I'm still organizing. This is Jared. He's the one that was four wheeling with me on that little beach island area here in San Diego a couple of videos ago. A lot of videos ago, I think, at this point. But yeah, we're going to go get some breakfast in his ambulance. No. Hash brown, sausage, eggs, cheese, all in a burrito from Jared. Garlic hummus. Oh yeah, oh garlic hummus in here too. Service right here. Us Ambo people gotta take care of each other, you know? We're outnumbered by all the sprinter people and the ProMaster people. All right, let's get the climbing gear out. Look at this freaking monster. I love seeing these two together. Okay, rock climbing stuff. Oh. Very excited. I haven't gone rock climbing in a very long time. So my arms are gonna be absolutely destroyed from this. Jared's finishing something up, I think for work. And I'm heading inside to beat up with my friend. He's already here. And then my other friend is right down the road and he just woke up. It's a rough start this morning. And we are at Mesa Rim Climbing and Fitness Center. Jared's gonna show us how to climb a nice chimney with no holes. Is that you cheating right now? Yes. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. That was impressive. That was good. Are you too tired for the go. rest of the day now? Yes, I'm going home. <laughs> that was good. Jared's basically pulling him up at this point. <laughs> Is he gonna make it? <laughs> well, I just did a couple of 512s, so I'm gonna do a 513. We just got done doing that right there. With no hands. So I just finished this 511, I walked up it. Yeah, he just, no hands. No, he didn't use legs, actually. We're gonna go ahead and 518 next. A what? 518? 518. I don't think I can do it with my wrist, though. Try to move away from the wall a little bit so you can spread your legs out. Unless that's easier for you. Oh, this is feeling good. The way that right leg is scrunched up might start cramping. Try to stretch. I'll switch to the other side if that's the case. There you go. Oh, shit. Don't look up. Just keep going. There you go. Wow, he's coming down. Disappointing. Wake up. Wake up, Brandon. <laughs> Uh, that's a lot harder than I thought. Seriously. All right. 
It's a nice solid workout, very much needed. I haven't worked out in a while. Now we're gonna go hang out on an island, a little beach island thing. So yeah, we're gonna head over there now and just chill, slack line a little bit, cook some food and relax. I'm so freaking hungry right now. So I'm gonna eat a couple peppers and head over to the beach. Then I'll actually cook some real food. It's so freaking loud here next to the highway. <clears throat> Thank God I saw this, that would have been a nightmare. Definitely would have fell. This would have fell. This is probably gonna fall. All right, let's roll. a little barter system he was gonna give me some of his tortillas if i gave him some eggs i think we're just gonna stop being lazy pieces of garbage and go to trader joe's literally right here we got another ambulance right here another van right there a big old school bus right there literally had to park behind trader joe's because the entire parking lot was just awful disaster so many freaking people That bag of groceries, a lot more than I expected to buy today. That's why I usually only take one of the little baskets and not the cart. Because when I take a full cart, I end up with way too many groceries and then sometimes they go bad. I try to get only as much as I can carry since it's only me. Off to the beach, let's go cook some delicious food. Home sweet home. Now it's time to decide what to cook. I've just been eating plantain chips. Roasted garlic hummus, put it on this flatbread. Got a bunch more chicken off the rotisserie chicken because I need to get rid of that thing. Gotta dump some salad in there, some sauce, maybe some jalapenos, don't know. Warm that thing up a little bit. I don't really know the right way to roll these things up. Leaving the ends open. Oh yeah, throw a little bit of sauce on them. And with views like this. I love it. Dudes be finding any excuse to use their wench. Slacklining, dude. <laughs> All right, well, we can't stay on the island because they close it at night and kick everybody out. So we're gonna go find a place to park for the night. I will catch you guys for the next video. Thank you guys for all the support. I appreciate everything. You guys are the best, and I will see you tomorrow for another video. Peace.